Optifine is one of the most popular Minecraft mods, and in this video, we're going to show you exactly how to get it. First things first, go to the second link in the description down below, and that's going to take you here. This is our in-depth text guide on getting Optifine that covers everything from downloading to installing it, but we're also going to cover all that in this video, so if you'd rather use the video, keep on following along. Otherwise, you can use the article. Once you're here, go ahead and click on Download Optifine to go to Optifine's official download page. Now, at the time I'm recording this, the most recent version is 1.20.6, and that's the version we're going to show you exactly how to install in this video, but this will work for other versions of Optifine as well, even into the future. So if it's Minecraft 1.21, this will show you how to install Optifine with that as well. Once you're here, go ahead and click on the preview versions drop down, unless you have a version under this. If there's a version here under preview versions already without you clicking preview versions, that's the one you want to go with because that means Optifine's no longer in beta, it's released. But with 1.20.6, we got to click preview versions. And then here we go. The preview version or beta version is here. Once you found it, click on mirror next to it to download the version of Optifine you want. And then it'll go to the, that version specific download page. In this case, it's 1.20.6, but it could be whatever version you want. Finally, click download here and the download will begin. You may need to keep or save it depending on your browser. And while this is downloading, how would message from our company, Symbol Game Hosting? Go to the first link in the description down below the breakdown of the XYZ slash SGH to start your very own 24 hour DDoS protected Minecraft server for you and your friends. You can easily add mods, plugins, or mod packs to your server and truly customize the server any way that you want. Plus, there's expert live chat support there to help you out. So stop struggling to host a Minecraft server and start your Minecraft server the simple way at the first link in the description down below the breakdown .xyz slash sgh. Nevertheless, we can now go ahead and minimize our browser and we want to move the Optifine file we downloaded from our downloads tab or our downloads folder into our desktop. Once we've done that and moved Optifine from our downloads folder to our desktop, it's time to open up Optifine. Now, I do want to mention, you will need Java 21 for this to work. So for example, if we right click on Optifine, click on open with, and we don't have Java here, or even if you do and you click OK and it doesn't work, it's because you need to get Java 21. Java 21 is required for Minecraft 1.20.6 mods such as Optifine and installing them. So even if you've had an old version of Java such as Java 17, it won't work anymore. You need Java 21, and in the description we have a link to this where you can go and download Java 21, get it installed, and all that stuff. Once you've got that, you may also want to run the jar fix. It's going to take all the jar files from your computer and link them back to Java, making them work together. At this point, though, we can go ahead and minimize our browser and open up Optifine by right-clicking on it, clicking on Open With, clicking Java, and clicking OK. I don't want to mention that you want to make sure Minecraft and the Minecraft Launcher are closed. Otherwise, this won't work. And once those are closed, go ahead and click Install. From there, Minecraft 1.20.6 or whatever version of Optifine you're installing will install. That is, unless you've never played Minecraft 1.20.6 before, if that's the case, go play it. If you're installing this for a Minecraft 1.21.1, for example, you would want to go play that version. Make sure you played the version of Minecraft you're installing Optifine 4 in order for it to install like this and work. Now at this point we can click OK, close out of the installer, and delete Optifine from our desktop. Now let's open up the Minecraft launcher. But in the Minecraft launcher, don't click play right away. You want to make sure that you're playing Minecraft with your Optifine installation. Now how do we see that? Well it's pretty easy. We can go to the installations tab up here at the top. When we do we should have Optifine, but if you don't it might be because modded is not checked in the top right. As you can see, modded is not checked, Optifine is not here. If we check modded, there it is. If you've got it, click play and click play again. But if you don't have Optifine or don't have the 1.20.6 version of Optifine, you can see under Optifine there, it says the version. We can go ahead and click new installation. You can name this anything you want. I'm going to name this simplegamehosting.com because that's the easiest way to play Minecraft with your friends. And then go ahead and click the versions drop down box here and select the version of Optifine you want. In our case, that's 1.20.6, but it could be any version for you. Then change the resolution here if you want. I'm just doing it so you can see better once we get in game and click create. Now we have this new simplegamehosting.com profile that's most importantly 1.20.6 Optifine, which is the version we want. Click play, click play again. And then now Minecraft's going to open up to the main menu and Optifine will be installed. While Minecraft's opening, I do want to mention that we have an alternative to Optifine in the description down below. It's called Notifine, and it has all of Optifine's features, but it updates way quicker than Optifine. So if you're struggling and like really wanting to play a new version of Minecraft, but Optifine's not updated yet, go get Notifine. It's got shaders, better performance than Optifine, and overall really, really good. Links to it on CurseForge and Modernth are in the description. But as you can see, Minecraft is now open, and what we can do is go into Options, and then Video Settings, and Shaders, because honestly, this is one of the main reasons people use Optifine. Optifine. We can go ahead and select Make Up Ultra Fast Shaders. I already had some shaders packs installed before this video to make this quicker. And then we can go ahead and click Done. Seems like I accidentally selected Complimentary, but that's okay. Now we can join a server here. And as soon as we join on in, we will be able to see that sure enough, shaders are active and working. Honestly, in my opinion, shaders are one of the best parts of Minecraft. So it's nice to see Optifine, which is 
how most people know to get shaders is now updated and the shaders packs are working in it. Look at that. Looks amazing. Complimentary. One of the best shaders packs out there for sure. What's your favorite shaders pack? Why do you want Optifine? Let us know in the comments and we'll see you in the next video. I am out. Peace.